Welcome back to and this guides in today's video we are going to show you how to insert picture in Microsoft Edge PDF. Let's begin. Now the first thing that you need to do is to click the try edge option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. Inserting a picture into Microsoft Edge is a straightforward process that can be useful in various scenarios, especially if you want to enhance your web browsing or manage content directly within the browser. Now, you can insert pictures into web pages to annotate or edit or tweak or comment on specific areas. This is useful for creating visual guides or providing feedback on web content because you can insert images to illustrate points in educational materials or training resources shared via the web. Now, what I'm going to do is go to my one of my folders that I'm currently working with and I'm going to try to insert that PDF or picture to the Microsoft Edge. Now, once you have located your PDF, all you're going to do is to right click on the exact file and then you have an option to open on uh, different platforms such as Illustrator, Photoshop, Brave if you have the Brave installed. You have the Firefox, Google Chrome, and of course, click on the Microsoft Edge. What will happen is we are going to be forwarded here on the PDF file wherein there's a lot that we can do. You see, you can edit for colors. That's going to be brush. For example, I'm going to hit this one. You see, there's a lot that you can do. Of course, you can uh, reduce it, the thickness. You can also highlight. This one for draw is going to be a lot different. All right, you can choose this one right here. Essentially, you can make final adjustments to the uh, file here, to the PDF file. Because, for example, when you are working on web design projects, you may want to insert images, of course, to edit that to visualize how different um, elements will look on a page. And for content creators, of course, you can add images to web pages or blog posts directly in Edge can help with visualizing and formatting content before publishing. And of course, from here, you can personalize your start page by a new tab right here to start page by adding custom images or text as backgrounds and of course you can use these pictures to create custom themes or visual elements in your backgrounds you also have an option to maximize uh fit to width you can uh of course this is the zoom in and zoom out of the uh, pdf there's a lot that you can do you can insert screenshots or images if you wanted also there's an option here where you can enter the PDF full screen. Of course, all you got to do is press escape to return to the page. And from there, you can also, you know, there's going to be a settings in here. You can hide all annotations, right? And of course, you can uh, show all the annotations. You also have an option to save it or um, save if you want it or print the PDF. There's a lot basically that you can uh, do here on the Microsoft Edge once you have imported the. And of course, these actions help integrate and manipulate images efficiently while using Microsoft Edge. Basically, you can copy it to your clipboard and paste it directly into web-based editors or forms, enhancing both productivity and customization. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next one.